too bright. Okay. Okay, hey y'all. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since. Today, my IKEA nightstands came. So, I think I'm gonna build one. I have two of them, so I tell my boyfriend I'll build one and then he'll build one. So, I have the box right here in front of me. It is really heavy. So, open it up. See how everything looks. I am so dumb. You don't have any tools. Oh, you are so dumb. You are really dumb. <laughs> I just put all of these pieces of this nice thing out. We have no tool. We have not been to the store to buy a tool set. So great. <sighs> okay, hey y'all. We just got back from the store. We actually ended up going to the store to get a tool kit so I could get that. Um, but those nice things, but... I ordered something off of Amazon and it came to me, so I went to go get that out of the um, mailbox. So, it's a fruit stand, and the shape of it could not have fit in this box, so I'm, I have to build it basically. But <clears throat> I was iffy about it, giving it, because I didn't want it to look weird or not match, but I think it'll be fine. But I don't know how. There's no instructions. This is the fruit stand. Does it make sense to y'all? Is this cute? Is this weird? Is this not it? I think it's pretty clean. The fruit in it? I'll show y'all once I put the fruit in. And I think it's cute. It's different. It was kind of difficult to like make sure these fit in here. Cause these spaces right here are pretty big. These apples are really small, but they stack up nice. I put the pineapple in the middle and then I just put the bananas on the back like that. Cause I don't know where else to put them. But yeah. But here's a toolbox. But yeah, it comes with a um, measure tape and I have forgot what these are. I think these are like tiny versions of screwdrivers. These are the nails and stuff that it comes with. The little, um, I forgot what these are called. I don't know what these are called, but and then the pieces to take off on and off the screwdriver, all the different shapes, the hammer. Pretty, not bad. It comes with the case, so that's not bad. But yeah, we got that. And then my boyfriend also has been using Amazon. Okay, my card got full. I need to order me some freaking SD cards. I keep forgetting. We just went to Walmart. I could have got me one. I just keep forgetting. Is this camera angled right? Girl, if you don't back up. But yeah, like I was saying, that my card got full. And I keep forgetting to order me some more SD cards. We just went to Walmart. I could have got one there. I didn't even. Anyways. But yeah, check out the food stand. I really like it. It's really nice. It's cute. I think it matches. And then... Oh, like I was saying, my boyfriend has been using Amazon a lot too for stuff uh, for the apartment. So he put an order in. He got some of these bowls. Yeah, he got some of these bowls. It's a five pack. It comes with the big one, and then you know, go down in size. And this is the smallest one. So it is two o'clock in the afternoon. It is October twenty-first today. Um, so I believe. Before this video, the last video I should have posted was the um, the spooky basket video. Um, I'm hoping so. Yesterday, what happened yesterday? Oh, yesterday I didn't vlog. I had a lot of personal stuff going on, and uh, just like I ran errands, getting stuff done. So if I really need, just needed to get done that I have not gotten done. So okay, hey guys, my boyfriend just got off of work, and on his way in, he got 
my packages. So I want to show y'all what I got. So whenever I stayed at my mom's house, my sister had a heating pad that I would use whenever like I would wake up and my back would be hurting or you know I was on my period. So now that I'm here, of course I left her heating pad there. And I thought, why not get my own? So I looked on Amazon and I was shocked to see they had so many options and like it didn't cost that much. I never asked her how much hers was, but I know hers was small. So I want a I wanted a bigger one and I feel like it was it's some good prices on there for like some good size heating pads. But yeah, I ordered one. I was really in the mood for one yesterday. Like it sounded so good to just lay down and have a heating pad, but Here's the box, and that's the brand. And my keys. It's a gray one. It has, it's supposed to have like three settings. Oh, well, this is a decent size. Not as big as I wanted it to be, but. Is that big to you? Is this sort of big? Yeah. yeah, that's a good size. Good enough for my back on my stomach. And here's the plug thing and the fitter. So it goes up and up in temperature. Not bad. It's really soft. I'm glad it's soft. Okay, my camera shut off. What didn't shut off my car? I got pulled again, of course. <clears throat> here's the next item. I saw this on Amazon. It just popped up, and I was like, oh my god, that is so cute. I have to get it. I'm just putting it on my nightstand next to me, but it's a. I'm gonna show y'all. It's a, um, a little frame thing for, I don't want to open and get it dirty, but it's a little frame thing for a Polaroid picture. I love Polaroid pictures, so I saw this and I thought it was so cute to just put on my nightstand. But it's this, it's a, a sh like, I mean, I think of Chanel when I see this, but perfume bottle, but it's a perfume bottle frame you just slide the polar picture in there and it's a frame and i thought that was so cute so, so like i said i want to do some fridge organization but i got these for my drinks so let me show y'all it's broke you're joking but i got these drink things to put in the fridge and put my cans in. But yeah, that's everything I got from Amazon. It's been too much money on Amazon. Update y'all later. So update y'all. It's a little later now. We ordered some food and we ate. It's 5.30 now. Um, we're not really doing anything today. So, but I was in my closet and I forgot that I, I believe I mentioned these in a previous vlog. I can't remember if I did or not. If I didn't, um, I'm sure y'all y'all know about all, about the the shoe boxes from the container store. You know they're like viral. A lot of sneakerheads have them. You know in their closets and stuff like that. So when I seen these, I've always wanted some, but I just didn't want to go pay all that money for them from the container store. I think they're really expensive. <laughs> so I remember seeing on TikTok that uh, Five and Below had some. Five below, five below, whatever it's called. They had some. They had their own. So I remember seeing. I was like, okay, like if I see them, I'm gonna get them. I'm not gonna go hunt them down though. And I remember going to a five below. It wasn't even one close to me. I think it was just like a random one. We went in there and I saw them. They had a whole bunch of packs actually. And so I got me two packs. It's a set of four. I think these were ten dollars each, which is not bad. Cause I believe. Let me see. I know they're expensive. Ooh. It says for six of them, it's, for these all transparent ones are $57.99. And for six large ones is $69.99. And for six large black ones is $69.99 for six. So if these turn out to be really nice, then that's crazy that's a good deal but this is what they look like they're gray they look like that so I figured I would open them up and put them together 
on camera with y'all. I've had these for so long. I don't know how long ago I bought these. I'm barely opening them up and putting them together. So, let's see how this goes. So, there it is. Oh wow, not bad. It's not like a sturdy plastic box. This is flimsy stuff, but it's not that bad, honestly. So, let's see then. So, here's the box. Let me just open this up and it opens like that. It's like class in there. I don't know how, but I have my just not forces, just random beer shoes like that. Just to test it out, so let's see. Hmm. There it is. Can you see? That's what it looks like. Wow. the cheese box. I think it's nice. I think it's worth it. Not that bad of a price. So I think I'm going to go ahead and build all these and then go put all whatever shoes I can put into them and then I'll update y'all later. Well, I'll see y'all in the next clip. Hello guys. It's the next day. Currently, I just got out of the shower. Um, I wanted to show y'all the shoe boxes that I put together. But yeah, this is what the shoe boxes look like. I put a couple of pair of my shoes, just some random pair of shoes in there. And I only got eight from, from the first ones I bought. I only bought two packs and they came in four, so I only have eight boxes. Um, but that's what they look like. I think they're really cute. I think they'll be so cute just to have, you know, my whole closet full of these uh, boxes. So, but yeah, I don't know if I should keep the shoe boxes to the shoes or not. Like, so if anyone's watching this and y'all have, any type of you know those shoe boxes that y'all put your shoes into do y'all throw the boxes away do i keep them uh leave a comment below because i'm really curious and i'm really stuck about that so the other day when i ordered the what did i order the heating pad when i ordered the heating pad that i showed y'all it said when i clicked on the heating pad that i bought it said promotion available so I clicked on that and it said to add a free item. You'll get it free with the purchase of the heating pad. And I was like, huh, oh, what? And yeah, so when I added the item, it was a laptop stand. And I was like, what? You just get this free? I didn't believe it. So I added this to the card and it was true and it worked. You get a free laptop stand with the heating pad. So I was like, okay, cool. Like, why not? You know, it's free. You don't have to pay for shipping or nothing. It literally was just free. So, I figured why not, and I'll show y'all. Oh, it comes in this nice velvet little tie string bag. Wow, it feels heavy. Let's see, I don't even know where my laptop is at. I have my iPad, if I can, that works. Wow, fancy dance. Oh, this is metal, straight metal. Oh. Oh, it's literally a stand. How does this work? Oh, you you walk this in these holes. If it works. Oh, that's cool. And then you just sit the laptop on here. And then you just sit the laptop right here and it just stands up. Oh, that's so cool. Wow. That's pretty cool to be free. If I want it higher, I just adjust it, right? So I'm gonna open the drink things and then put them in the fridge and I'll show y'all what they look like. I know the glare is like annoying and then I get those things right here and it's so frustrating. I 
comes to hot and sizzling. When I got them to drink them, I was thinking about just, see, look, I have them. Oh my gosh. But I was thinking about um, just keeping the other two and just using them, the other one. It's broken, but if I fill it up with drinks, it won't be a big deal, I guess. But I felt the piece that fell out of it that was inside the packaging, and then like it's pretty sharp. So I don't know if I want to keep that or not. If we grab it or touch it and we cut ourselves or whatever, but I was thinking just keep another two, and I would probably just get charged for them. But I'll have four or three and one broken one. So I was thinking about doing that because I the price was pretty a good price. Like there was a coupon off too, so it made them even cheaper. So. I didn't pay an expensive price for them, so I'm still deciding. I have until I think January to take it back to other two, so we'll see. But I don't have that many drinks in my fridge, so. Okay, so I'm gonna go fill these up and put them in the fridge and then I'll show y'all once I'm done. Okay, here are the drink container things. I had one extra uh, Sprite, so I just put that right there. But we still have Twisted Teas when we first moved in and we have sparkling water drinks and then there's our water. So this is like a whole bottom row of our fridge, but that's how the drinks look. Okay, hey guys. Oh, I took my glasses off. I was getting those little sweat things. Currently, it is Monday. It is 1.30 in the afternoon right now. Um, I've gotten up, me and my boyfriend, we've... Left out early today just to get everything out the way so we could chill for the rest of the day. But um, what did we do? I had to send the packages off, so I went to Target to get a box. Um, and then at Target, they're already starting to put Christmas stuff out. And literally when we went today, the, pe the workers were putting out the Bullseye Playground, like Christmas stuff. So I got two things. So I got a pillow. I got this pillow. It says snuggle up. And it's, um, I think these are only $5. Like any pillows that, that, that are inside of um, Bullseye Playground, a little dollar section at Target, they're like $5. So I got that one. And I got these. It says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. And then it has a little black and white checker one. So I got these. These are cute. I think these are $3. No, $5, I think. I can't remember. But I got those. We went to Target, I went to drop the packages off, and then we went to go eat. Um, I told them let's go try the wings at um, Buffalo Wild Wings, the the Doritos, the purple bag. I think they're uh, sweet chili. Um, I like those chips, I love those chips. I remember in school they used to have those chips and I used to always buy them. So I figured I would like the wings. We went to go try them and I don't know, um, I haven't been to Buffalo Wild Wings in a long time. I really don't care for Buffalo Wild Wings. I used to go late at night after work if they were open and there was no other options and I wanted wings. Other than that, I didn't go and it's been some years since the last time I went. And we went today and it's just, yeah, like the wings. The wings, it's a cool idea, but they're not good. Like when, when they when they first uh, brought the wings out, it was a smell to them. I don't know if that like changed my appetite when I smelt them and I smelt them and then we tasted them and then it's like, they taste like the chips, but they have a taste to, like the sauce has a taste to it. And that taste is just, I couldn't get over it. And my boyfriend didn't like them either. So, yeah, that, there's a no for me. I thought they were gonna be really good. Everybody that I seen try them on TikTok said they were good. So maybe we just had some bad ones or a bad batch. But other than that, if they weren't, those are not good. But yeah. So then, after that, we went to the grocery store. I'm gonna cook tonight, so had to get a couple of things for whatever I'm cooking tonight. I know I started buying Christmas stuff early, and of course I'm gonna vlog that whenever I buy the Christmas stuff and whenever we go get our tree and stuff, we decorate. I wanna vlog all that, hopefully this time. Um, but like, how early do y'all put y'all Christmas stuff out? How early do y'all go? How early do y'all start shopping for Christmas stuff and how early do y'all put it out? I really want to know. I'm curious. Am I too early? I feel like every year, I think I mentioned this in a previous vlog, I can't remember, but I was saying like Halloween, I felt so overwhelmed just because we moved the beginning of October. I felt like the whole time we were shopping for stuff for our apartment, I should have been getting Halloween stuff too just because it's already out. And that was stressful and now it's still October and they're already putting out Christmas stuff and if y'all don't know, like especially Target, their Christmas stuff goes really fast. Target is so popular now. 
especially like the bullseye playground you know it's cute stuff and it's cheap so like it goes so fast so i feel like every time i go to target and i see the stuff i need to get it just because i don't feel i'm gonna be able to get it again and a lot of people buy the stuff to resell and they sell it for so expensive than what it's worth and that's just like frustrating and i'm just having you know i don't want to miss out like i don't want to miss out on it so i don't know that's kind of like stressful but yeah leave a comment below letting me know like when do y'all put your christmas stuff out like do y'all just go with the flow do y'all plan it do y'all have an exact day like the day after thanksgiving the night of thanksgiving you know like black friday when do y'all put your christmas stuff out and then when do y'all start shopping for christmas stuff put a comment below let me know